Hello everyone, this is Amrit Pal Singh. Welcome to the next video of Neo4j. Guys, in this video, I'll be talking about how we can get started with Neo4j. In my previous video, I've already have talked about the introduction to Neo4j, what is Neo4j, what is Cypher language, uh, what are nodes, what are relationships and all right. So in this video, I'll be guiding you how we can download the Neo4j Enterprise Edition and how we can get started with it. So guys, you can see in the front of you, I've already have opened up the Google search page in which I have written in Neo4j Enterprise Edition download, all right? So in this uh, case, when you just typed in and press enter, you'll get the first official link of Neo4j. So just click on it. So it will take you to the new page in which uh, you'll be getting options that which Neo4j you want to download depending upon the platform. Actually, we are more concerned with Neo4j Enterprise Edition 4.4.8 so because I'm using Linux, uh, so I'll be going with this. But in your in your case, if you're making use of uh, Windows, you can go with this as well. So when you click on it, all right, so it will be taking you to the new page in which you have to just uh, fill in your details here, right, your name and all, right. So afterwards, you fill your details and it will give you a free 30 day trial. All right. So this is the uh, uh, best way to get start with this. Although we do have uh, the cloud edition of Neo4j as well, which is called AuraDB. I'll talk about it in a separate video. But this is the uh, uh, good way to start, get start with the Neo4j. So in this case, guys, once you uh, fill the details, it will start downloading. Afterwards, you'll be getting this in your uh, downloads page. You have to extract because it is, it is in the zip folder or the TAR folder, TR extension. So once you extract, it'll uh, I have extracted it in uh, my home uh, location. You can see Neo4j Enterprise, right? Once you are done with this, what's the next process? You have to just open up your shell, okay? Then go to the Neo4j uh, Enterprise uh, folder. Over there, when once you uh, come inside it with the cd command, then you have to just run this command: dot forward slash bin forward slash Neo4j space console once you run this command all right so it will be you'll be getting this option starting and all right once it's got started what's the next process guys next process is, is to open up the browser right open up your browser and in the browser you have to just type in localhost colon 7474 right i'm again repeating you have to just write here localhost 7474 so once you click on it it will be opening up the browser for you all right so here this is the platform where we'll be writing all all the queries right you can see here they are given a lot of documentation guides here so you can uh, just uh, go through it to get uh, yourself uh, updated with all the uh, basics but i'll be guiding you in my upcoming videos so how to get started with uh, neo4j uh, next video i'll be talking about uh, how to create a uh, node right how to establish a relationship between the node right i hope you must have uh, understood uh, with this short little video how to get started with Neo4j. Thank you guys. See you next video